there was a. <laughs> I speak well. <laughs> we just moved that. <laughs> it's not where it used to be. Hang on. So good. Hi, everybody. I am, I am a little punchy like a few of us are. Uh, I mentioned last week we just uh, returned, us circus freaks just returned from clown school. Uh, I'm now a graduate. Second, second time through the program, my brain is completely, completely broken. Uh, last year, they filled my head full of stuff, and I came back, and I tried to find something that would be uh, useful to not just clowns, because I know not everybody here. It'd be fun to think if we were all clowns, but this would be even more of a train wreck than it is. Um, but I, I went looking for something that was kind of universal to, to bring back, and I had that in my head this year. And unfortunately, that meant that, that was all I was, I was really focused on, trying to find something for you guys. And I was getting really frustrated, because I was working on my stuff, and I was working on that, and I'm looking for this thing, and I, and I don't find it until the very last, the, the whole thing goes by in a blur. It's five days of very intensive, locked in a room with 20 other clowns. Yeah, it's, so it's a lot, you know, it's a lot like this, only a smaller room. But I found something, um, and... It really got into the it really got into the idea of, of, of all types of performers and maybe even you know, a life lesson. I thought I might I might tell you about it real fast. Um, one of the last things we did we did do a student performance, and we had to enter the stage and stand on the stage and sort of introduce our character, sort of like I'm doing now. I we introduce our character. You know, hi everybody. You guys know me. Shut up, Russ. Get on with the show, and then I leave, and then I have to exit. And uh, the mentor, the guru of the program is a, is a guy by the name of Dick Monday, Monday the Clown. He's a, he's a genius. He's living up here. Everything has multi-layers of depth and meaning. I could just not imagine having breakfast with this guy because everything would, would you like some toast? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. Is it a test? And that would be how everything is. So he says, you have to think about when you enter a scene, this is a scene, you have to think about where you've been, where you are and, and, and where you're going after that. And, you know, of course, those are stage directions. Logistically speaking, I gotta trot my butt up here, stand center stage in front of the camera, look at you and go, hi, and, and then I gotta get the hell out of here, otherwise we don't get to have a show. So, I mean, that's, that's the way to look at it logistically. Then, uh, metaphorically, you start thinking about the fact that when I get up here, I bring everything I am to this moment. Now, you may not see it all. Uh, maybe in these pants it's very well hidden. Uh, but there's a, lot of, there's a lot of how I got to be this person, and, and that applies to any kind of a performer. You know, if you're a spoken word artist, if you're a musician, if you're a dancer, everything you know shows up here in some way. And then you gotta think about where you're going. I mean, we all know this show is going straight to hell. <laughs> but generally speaking, I would love to pretend, just like I would like to pretend we're all clowns, I'd love to pretend that we're all, yeah, we're all on a journey, we're all on these paths, and I'd love to think that we're all gonna be together right until the part where we crash into a wall at high speed. But we're probably gonna, at some point, people might, it's a terrible, I mean, I get all just thinking about it, but we're gonna go off and we're gonna cheer each other onto our individual endeavors, and that's really what it's gonna be about. We're gonna think more about that than we're gonna think about dropping dead. Uh, but the idea that this journey exists for every performer, seems so universal. And then I think about the fact that how lucky we are. I mean, we get to take all of our stuff and we get to come up here and be bombarded by these huge lights and surrounded by all of you who are so invested in this process where we get to work on our stuff. And it may not always be great because sometimes you know, we tried, but we tried in good effort. And sometimes we have an amazing real moment where something real comes out and we get to work on that. And more importantly, we get to take a minute and bathe in that, just kind of just exist in this moment where we can just pause and say, hey, 
this is where I've arrived and, and that's where I'm heading next. So I, I wanted to say, think about that journey as a performer and as a person as you go through your, as you go through your thing, realize that we, where we've been, where we are and where we're heading are, are really important things. And realize how lucky we are to have this place where every week we can get together and just enjoy the fact that we get to take a moment and see where we are. We call that the open stage. Welcome. It's right here. It's right here.